how to fix if Netflix is actually buffering. Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. I am Bimo from App Guide. In today's video, I'll simply show you how you can fix if the Netflix app keeps buffering on your phone. But before we get started, as always, if you are new to our channel, do make sure to leave a like, hit that subscribe button, and without any further ado, let's get started with today's video. Now, the number one reason for buffering on Netflix, which wouldn't happen on most cases, is actually whenever your internet connection is just too slow. For example, if you have a internet connection, but then it's actually set to very, very well, to this low, I'd recommend you to switch your network connection or switch to even cellular to try to see if that fixes the issue. If that doesn't, there are also a couple of things which we can do within the Netflix app. So open Netflix and then first of all, simply log into your account and then tap on the profile icon on the top right and go to app settings. Once you go to app settings right over here, you want to make sure that the mobile data usage is actually set to automatic. So if it's set to maximum data, it is going to use the maximum of your data and when it's not available, it is going to keep buffering. So you want to make sure that it's set to automatic to actually automatically adjust the quality depending upon your internet connection. And after that, you can also set to download video quality and you can set it to standard if you want to. And there are basically a couple of things which you can do. I would also recommend you to actually go ahead and check your network. So go ahead and you can see test your internet connection for any problems that might prevent you from using Netflix. So tap on the start test button so you can see Netflix Android server, Netflix internet connection and you can see this, they are both working just fine. Go ahead and also check your internet speed test. So go ahead and go to this network and you can see this will actually set and then test your internet speed. So if it's anything up to 10 to 15 megabytes per second, then it means that your internet speed is working just fine. In my case, it's 190 megabytes per second, and which means my network connection is also excellent. So I relatively do not have that issue. But basically, this is it. Hopefully, some of these solutions may have worked for you. If it did help solve your issue, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. If you have any more questions, queries, or doubts, simply also make sure to leave them down below. Thank you very much for watching till the end of this tutorial and see you soon in our next video.